Hey, what's going on, YouTube? Like, I don't know where to start. I don't know if this is Spotify or Sony doing this. Most likely it's probably Sony because they don't know what they're doing with a lot of their stuff anyway. Um, look at this. All I'm trying to do is play some Street Fighter and listen to some music. I'm not trying to stream. Look at this, this car garbage been loading for 15 minutes. Watch when I close the app. Close the app, everything is closed. Go back into it. And it's not gonna start. It'll go to my music. It's gonna show me the music I got. Okay, I lied, no it won't. It won't even do that. Like Sony, I know it can't be Spotify because, okay, I'm going to go to my music. All I'm going to do is try to play one song. This is on. You guys seen this. I'm pushing the button. This song is not playing. If I try to go down there to that play button, all it does is take me here. And it's not playing. And they can't be Spotify. It's got to be on Sony's end because, like, Spotify is working on all my other. It works on my tablet. It works on my cell phone. It even works on this TV. But I can't get it to play on a PlayStation. Sony can't even get they they crap together, man. I played a game on a VR called here we lie or here you lie or something like that that garbage gave me a headache man like what the f what like sony is pathetic man sony is freaking pathetic now granted i've been a, a good a pretty good sony fan for a while but I mean, like every time they do an update, they screw up the place. They they shouldn't do no more firmware update. This is Sony. This is what I think of their firmware updates. Stay away from those firm. Don't update the PlayStation no more. Matter of fact, when the PS Pro come out, don't freaking touch it. Don't upgrade it. Don't update it. Don't do nothing. Let that. Let it stay the the hell the way it is. And stop giving us sorry ass PlayStation Plus games too. I can't wait till my Plus run out, man. I'm never getting it again, ever. And I got two years to wait till that garbage is over. Close the application again. Go back into it. This is the worst. And while I'm on the subject of stupid bad ideas and upgrades, why are they making trying to make it seem like curved TVs are like the way to go? Curved TVs is a freaking game. Hey, what are they gonna do? Make curved sound bars next? Like if I see a curved sound bar, I, I, I'm, I'm I'm most likely to freaking piss on it right there where I see it in the store. Like, <laughs> like, why, why would they waste money making a curved soundbar? Like, I'm quite sure there are no curved soundbars because anybody that makes a curved soundbar is stupid. But, I mean, come on, like, let's think about this for a minute. You making a curved soundbar, a curved TV for what reason? So people over here can see over here, and people over here can see over. Here. Like that makes I I don't I don't know. That's not going to bother. They need to do something else to make that gimmick work. Because that's not just, that's not going to work with me. I'm going to restart my freaking gay station. I'm not going to Microsoft. You can't keep a girl happy with a name like Microsoft anyway. Or Peacock for that matter. But anyway, like, they have curved TVs. It's a gimmick. Um... Curved sound bars is a gimmick. Like, I mean, I see what they were doing when they did this with my TV. They wanted to stabilize it while they made the base curved. I can understand that. It's a curved base. But, 
like I said, I haven't seen I haven't seen any curved sound bars, but I, I bet you some idiot out there is gonna make them because they want to try to make money. Like I, I don't understand. I don't understand the gimmick to a curved anyway, except for this base that I just showed you. It makes about as much sense as Sony's updates. Leave the firmware alone. If Sony comes out with another firmware update, just like if I didn't need to get online, I wouldn't download those stupid updates. I guarantee you I would not. I would not download those updates because every time they come out with an update, they screw something else up. I was able to play a whole full hours and hours and hours of Street Fighter while I'm listening to Spotify. Now all of a sudden, a song stopped and I can't freaking play it. Like, leave the PlayStation alone. Leave, if, if it's effed up firmware, you shouldn't have put it in there in the first place. No more firmware updates. Like, I can't take that garbage no more. The firmware is trash. Uh, I don't know. They're just coming out with a bunch of stuff. Well, I mean, the only good thing is they didn't come out with curved sound bars yet. There's no way that there's going to be any curved sound bars because that's basically surround sound. Basically, that's about it. Um... That being said, I'm going to get out of here and try to boot this game back up again. Oh, where the heck is Spotify? Okay, we're going to try this again. Going to try this one more time. Oh, God. It's still not loading. This is sad. This this is really sad. PlayStation is about the sad. Like, man, this can't. Okay, let's go over here to my Spotify on my app. Watch it boots right up. Home right there. The PlayStation is wired. This, boom, right there. All my recently play, and I can just touch something and it'll play. I don't want to say the full album. I just want. Oh, I can download it. See, look at that. I got all this stuff on my. And this is wireless. The PlayStation is hardwired. There's the modem right there. It's wired. There's no reason that this garbage should be like this. Sony, every last one of you fuckers is pathetic. I'm not a Microsoft fan, but that's why they beat. I know y'all got something up y'all sleeve, but that's why Microsoft beat y'all. How you gonna make 4K gaming, but don't put a 4K Blu-ray player in your freaking PS Pro? How's Pro? The PS Slim, I mean the PS regular 4 is better than the Pro. I'm the PS4 Pro. What can you do? Can you play Blu-rays? No. Can you play 4K? No. Well, what can you do? Nothing. I've got teraflops. I've got freaking all this other stuff. Don't get me wrong. I am going to get a pro, but I just, wow. I'm just, I'm not understanding why. Look at this. This is, this is pathetic. This is very pathetic. This makes absolutely no sense whatsoever. This is the saddest display of garbage I've ever seen. This is pathetic. Everybody at Sony should have their degrees pissed on. Where the hell did they learn their degrees from? A freaking rat in a maze or something? Let's put a whole bunch of Sony representatives in a maze and put a piece of cheese. Whoever, f the first one that gets to it, that's who'll get the degree. Like, that, you guys are fucking idiots. Restart the PlayStation 4. This is sad. I'm done. This is this, this little, little F-ups like this that make me not even want to be a gamer no more. And if I do, I'll go back to freaking Nintendo and Super Nintendo. 
I will not I'll go past stay with my Dreamcast. I never had a problem out of my Dreamcast ever. Never had a problem out of the freaking PlayStation 2. The PS4 and the PS3 all have these kind of problems. Pathetic ass, worst, useless firmware updates. They how you gonna fuck up your own shit? How you gonna mess up your own freaking? This is god. This is awful. Anyway, this is Rain Phoenix. I ain't finna try to sign it. I'm finna go and do something else. I lost my urge to play now. Sony, y'all can suck all the dried shit out of a leprechaun's ass. That being said, this is Rain Phoenix. I'm getting out of here. But, I mean, aside, I am going to try it again because I want to play Street Fighter. I had some nice music lined up that I was playing with. And it's probably still not going to line up. I mean, load up. Oh, damn. I can see it. But I guarantee you, a needle in my ass won't play this. This is on. You see the blue light? It's on. It's not playing. I can't even play nothing else. If I go to more, don't start me over. Just, I can't do nothing. This is pathetic. Sony, get your shit together. I'm out.